It's time for a wellness revolution. Brought to you by Hotsi Health and Wellness Center. Honest discussion on maintaining health and wellness naturally to enjoy a better quality of life. He's the doctor fighting to let you keep your doctor. Now, Dr. Stephen Hotsi. Welcome to Dr. Hotsi's Wellness Revolution. I'm Stacey Banfield here with Dr. Stephen Hotsi, founder of the Hotsi Health and Wellness Center. We've got a great program today. With all of the attention that's been placed on the immune system, a lot of people don't realize that an allergy or having allergies can adversely affect the immune system. Isn't that right, Dr. Hodes? Exactly. An allergy is an abnormal reaction by a person's immune system to normal substances in the environment, things they breathe in the air. We treat grass pollens, dust mite, mold spore, and animal danders, foods that they eat, chemicals they come in contact with. All these in a person that has a genetic predisposition towards allergies will begin to make abnormal reactions within their system. And this will burden the immune system. What happens when you have allergies, you make antibodies to these various allergens as if they were some kind of foreign pathogen in your body, like a virus or bacteria. You make these antibodies and they bind to mast cells that line your nasal pharynx and your throat and in your lungs and down in your esophagus. And when you're exposed to these allergens over and over again, those antibodies will rupture the mast cells spilling out histamine. Ah, what does that do? Sounds histamine familiar. Histamine causes the blood vessels and the tissues to swell and to drain. And now you've got a culture media. You've got that chronic drainage. You've got a culture media for an infection, for a viral or bacterial infection. And that's what inevitably has with people that have recurrent and chronic allergies. They'll get sinus infections or bronchial infections, skin disorders, stomach problems, all because they're having an abnormal reaction in the, by their immune system to these common allergens. Now, any of these things can lead to the rupture and the spilling of histamine. That's why people run out to the store and say, give me an antihistamine, I got allergies. The antihistamine is meant to neutralize the histamine that reacts. Uh, and causes the tissue to swell. And and by the way, this happens in the brain as well. People can have allergies, and it can affect the way they think and the way they feel mentally and their sharpness. So and it, can, it can adversely affect kids and give them autoimmune disorders. So when Hotsi Health and Wellness Center started back in 1989 and moved here to our current facility in 1991, we were strictly an allergy practice. That's all we did. We treated people for chronic allergy problems, the recurrent sinuses, the recurrent ear infections, the recurrent bronchitis, the asthma, skin disorders, uh, eczema, and all these sort of things. We treated for that, and initially we started using, with our testing, after we tested, skin tested, we would then have injections of these various allergens, and you take an allergy shot on a weekly basis. Well, that lasted for about four or five years, and I was encouraged by other allergists in my society to use sublingual drops. So we took the various very allergens that we gave on a weekly basis, and we put them in little dropper bottles, and we began to give people allergy drops under their tongue on a daily basis. And we found out that we had tremendous results with that, and we basically eliminated all injectable allergy immunotherapy. Well, just over the last several years, we have become aware of the wonderful opportunity we have to provide an even more convenient and more affordable allergy treatment for patients. It is called low-dose immunotherapy. And instead of having to take a shot once a week or drops under your tongue every day, you put drops under your tongue once every seven or 10 weeks. And those drops contain the common airborne allergens, common food allergens, and even the common chemicals that people are allergic to in minute doses. It's interesting. Allergy is very much like homeopathic medicine. Most physicians don't understand allergy treatment other than, hell, we'll take an antihistamine, you know, take an antihistamine. Mm -hmm. You got an infection, take an antibiotic. You know, we'll give you a Medrol dose pack and you'll be over it. Well, that doesn't treat the underlying allergic disorder which is caused by the abnormal antibodies that are made to allergens. And for those people that have allergens, it costs costs a ton of time and money, loss of work. Mm -hmm. They say that allergy, uh, billions and billions of dollars are lost every year 
in the workplace and to individuals because they have recurrent and chronic allergy problems, which flare up commonly in the fall and in the spring. But they can happen year-round, particularly if you have mold sensitivities. And in Houston, we've got a big problem with that because we've got a lot of wet weather and we've got a lot of mold problems in Houston. So what we want to do is provide a very simple system of treatment of allergies, and we're excited to offer low-dose immunotherapy. And it's going to dramatically cut the cost of allergy treatment because instead of having to supply you with bottles that you have to take on a daily basis and you have to have five sets of bottles every year, we can treat you once every seven to ten weeks with one dose. And we can adjust that dose based upon your response to it after we've done testing on you. We'll create a a dose for you. And then we're going to follow you and see how you do and see if you have resolution of your symptoms. I'm so confident in this because we've had somewhere on the order of 80 to 90 percent resolution of allergy problems using this particular method, which means you don't have to go anywhere. We send you the allergy drops and you inject it once, not even with a needle. You just squirt it under your tongue once every seven to ten weeks. Well, that's remarkable. And within 18 months, you can cut that back to maybe once a year or twice a year is all you have to take it. And what it does is it it doesn't block the antibodies. It stimulates the T cells, which are a certain type of, of uh, immune cell in your body. It down-regulates those cells so they don't create inflammation in your body from the allergy reaction. And it's a remarkable treatment that we've had great success with. I'm so confident in it that if anybody wants to get on the allergy treatment, I give them a year, and if it doesn't work out in a year, I will completely return your money if it didn't work. I'm so confident in this therapy. And we've used this on young children who've had terrible problems with eczema all over their body because they had combined food and inborn and inhaled allergy problems. And we've treated these young kids, one, two, three years old, and they just resolved their eczema. It's remarkable. So I'm excited to present low-dose immunotherapy that we're offering now at the OC Health and Wellness Center as part of our allergy program. And I want to encourage you, if you're having allergy problems, if you have recurrent and chronic allergy problems, or you and your kids do, make sure you get your allergies under control, and that takes the load off your immune system. Allergies load down your immune system, and when that happens, your immune system isn't capable of responding to viruses and bacteria that it should be fighting off if it's working over time trying to fight off the allergen that you come in contact with in your environment. So we want to stop the allergy reaction, take the load off the immune system so your immune system is healthy and well. And when your immune system is healthy and well, guess what? You'll be healthy and well. Yes, and that's such a great point you make too, Dr. Hotsey, about inflammation, what you were saying right. earlier, because you like to say that inflammation is sort of that underlying root cause of, of disease in general. Right. And so when your body is inflamed, you're really opening up that door uh, for other conditions. So definitely, if you think that you have allergies, you should definitely get tested. And this is just a, it's a game changer. It's a no brainer, money back guarantee easy to use, very effective. We really encourage you to give us a call today at the Hotsey Health and Wellness Center, 281-698-8698. That's 281-698-8698. It would be a privilege to partner with you. Thank you for joining us today at Dr. Hotsey's Wellness Revolution. A special thanks to Physicians Preference Pharmacy, formerly Hotsey Pharmacy, proud sponsor of Dr. Hotsey's Wellness Revolution podcast. Information provided on this radio program is neither intended nor implied to be a substitute for professional medical advice and is not intended to replace the services of a physician, nor does it constitute a doctor-patient relationship. You should not use information from this radio program to diagnose or treat a health problem or disease without consulting with a qualified health care provider. If you have or suspect you have an urgent medical problem, promptly contact a professional health care provider or call 911. Dr. Hotze's Wellness Revolution radio program advises you to always seek the advice of a physician or other qualified health provider prior to starting any new treatment or with any questions you may have regarding a medical condition. Any application of the recommendations from this radio program is at the listener's discretion.